that where kids get to talk about news, I think that would be really fun. I really like that because it gives awareness to kids and it lets us have it kid friendly. It's the five uh, W's and one H. Who, what, where, when, why, and how? Who, what, where, when, why? And what's the other one that goes? How? We always want to ask the who, what, when, where, and why when we're trying to create a story or when we're, when we're covering a story that we want to get important information across to people. And that's what we do at CBC Kids News. For a long time, news was just for adults. But at CBC Kids News, we think it's time for kids to ask the questions. Here are five things you'll need in your toolkit. A topic. The plan. The question line. And equipment. Subjects. Being a journalist can be very rewarding. But like anything else, to get good at it, you'll need to practice. So what are you waiting for? Get started. Take your toolkit and start telling stories that will make the news. And when you're done doing it, do it again. And keep doing it until there are no more questions left to ask. Hello everyone, this is CBC Kids News. I am your host, Sunny. Here tonight we'll be interviewing Kelly. Now Kelly, what inspired you to do skating? Uh, I started when I was little and I thought it was fun so I continued doing it. It felt pretty good, but it was sort of hard like to move it up and down because it feels like hard, but it's not really. After this experience, I kind of want to be a reporter to like report the news. News isn't just for adults. I would pick art. Probably the aspects of art because there's so much um, different ways you can create art. It's all around us. Right now, I'd be aware about pollution because we've got a lot of pollution in the world right now. About how soccer originally started. We are Kids News! <laughs>